Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. And I have a, another wax order to share with you. This is a new to me vendor that I've never tried before. I was watching Tara, Tara Lynn. Is that your name, Tara? I'm sorry, is, do you go by Tara or Tara Lynn? I can't remember. I feel like I've seen it like several different ways. Anyway, she's on YouTube and she does a lot. She does a lot. She does a lot of wax hauls with vendors that are, they're from vendors that I don't necessarily, I've never heard of before, or maybe I have, but just never ordered from them. And she likes to try out, it kind of seems like she likes to try out new vendors and give them a try. So she has recently ordered, I think she's ordered several times from this vendor and it's called Sassy Wax Melts, <clears throat> excuse me. And this is her card, Sassy Wax Melts. This is, she is um, on Etsy and her name is Cheryl out of Washington. There is the Etsy address and email and Instagram, okay? So cute card. So I wanted to try, okay, <clears throat> I went on to the website and her stuff is just beautiful. It's some of the, it's really up there to, with some of the prettiest wax that I've ever seen. I have no idea how it smells. I can tell you right now, I've already taken this out of the box and smelled the three tarts that I ordered, <laughs> which... Uh, is not many and we're going to go over that in a second um, about the the price and I think it's a little bit more pricey but I think you're getting you know you're paying a lot for creativity which I don't mind doing every once in a while but we're just gonna we're gonna take a look at it but so I only ordered three things three little tarts but this is how it came it's good. Normally, you know, if someone ordered three tarts, people would be like, what the heck is she doing? Well, I just thought this was so, such a cute personal touch. I mean, she obviously made up for the higher price by just the packaging. And, and I could be wrong about the higher price. I don't know. But so everything came in this little gift box. Okay. It was, it was, this was wrapped in cute paper and had some little stickers on it. And, um, of course, I can't get it to look like it did because I am not good at repacking. But how cute is that? So, a little butterfly gift box. And then, on, when I opened it up, I had the, the card was on top. And then it came with um, this note, which I'll let you go ahead and read. Angela, thank you so much for your order and support. Please let me know of any concerns or questions. I mean, always, Cheryl, how, that's very nice. And the cute fox note, note, but I love getting a personal note. I really do. And then, of course, candy is the way to my heart. And I have some candy hearts. Because, you know, Valentine's Day is right around the corner. Oh, and y'all, I just got my nails done today. And, um, <laughs> the man who does them, I just, I'll give him pretty much, I just go in there and say, just, I want pink and sparkly, and then I leave it up to him. And this is what he ended up doing, except he didn't, since, since it's Wednesday and Valentine's Day is Friday, he didn't do the hearts. He put me a little, a little flower, and I told him that was probably going to be the only flowers I get for Valentine's Day. He thought that was funny. Okay, back to the package. I got two packages of the candy hearts. Oops. And <clears throat> some chocolate hearts. Is this Dove? No, it's Palmer. So it's going to say, ooh, I'm going to dove. Palmer's double chocolate. So cute touches. And those are going to probably be given away to 
because I'm not supposed to be eating candy right now. Then she gave me some samples. I couldn't believe it because I didn't order very much, right? But all right, so sample number one is in this cute, cute shape right here. Uh, I guess a flower of some sort. And then on the back, and these are really nice, thick bags. I really like these bags. She didn't chimp on the packaging. Pretty labels, pretty bags, <laughs> nice bags. This is Jack Spratt, which is fresh baked bread, cupcakes at Tiffany's, Pizzelle, which I think is an Italian cookie, carrot cake, monkey bread, buttercream. She puts the pour date on there, which it was just poured like four days ago. <laughs> and do not eat. And it's just a really good bakery scent. And I can smell it on cold, so that's good. Um, I am looking at her website right now off to the side here. And these are made from, it says, one-of-a-kind handmade soy and beeswax melts. So that was sample number one. The next one is in this cute heart that has like a touch of... Um, I think like mica powder on it. And this is called, this is in the scent of Ace of Spades. Black raspberry vanilla, lemon curd, pears, cotton candy, caramel, and French vanilla. Interesting. What am I smelling when I smell this? Hmm. I smell the black raspberry and something That is a, just a weird scent to me. <laughs> With a caramel, I kind of smell that. I don't know, I'll try it, it's different. I would say mostly I get like a fruity, I thought I got like a little fizziness, and I guess it's from the citrus from the lemon curd. Good. Then this is another sample, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. A beautiful like rosette is that what you say Ros rosette and this is fairy cocktail snow fairy blue cotton candy blue cotton candy and marshmallow fluff again do not eat I wonder what this smells like yeah this smells like um the fairy snow fairy from is that what it's called from lush I smelled this, this scent before. That's mostly what it smells like to me. Pretty though. And then this is the last sample. Pretty. Tropical salsa. Mango peach salsa, pineapple mango, sugared peaches. I get the mango for sure. Mango. It really smells like, okay. It does smell like mango. My, my husband buys, not fresh mango, but he buys um, like diced mangoes in a jar because he makes this mango salsa to put on um, the uh, fish tacos that he makes. It's so delicious. He's a really good cook. But that's what it reminds me of when I smell it is that mango, that mango salsa. Okay, so those are the those are the samples. Now let's get to the four things I ordered. Okay. Look at that. This, I'm gonna have to take this out just to, just to show you the size. Now it's beautiful, okay? It is, it's just, let's just look at it all the way around. It is very, it is very beautiful with the glitters and the mica and the little bitty pieces of little, like little leaves and little berries on top. And then on the bottom, it's just gorgeous with all the detail, right? Okay, so this by itself, let me see if there's any on here that are left. Uh, hold on. 
I don't think there is. I think that these were like, I want to say $3 and something. $3 and three dollars and something okay three thirty three oh five I'm not really sure okay for I mean this is probably an maybe an ounce and a half I don't know so is that is that pricey yes I think it is because I can get like two ounce scent shots for for, for less than that and like just like another place I ordered that has cute scent shots they're like a dollar 75 but am I getting like this beautiful artwork no I just and you know what everyone says it just melts it just melts and you're not gonna say you know what I know it melts but I still want to be pretty I don't like I mean I don't really I like for it to look pretty <laughs> looking at it Sorry. I don't know. I just, I'm really into that. Okay. I like, you know, I like arts and crafts. And so this just, to me is just like, I mean, it's just beautiful. So the scent of this is blueberry surprise, which is blueberry cheesecake, buttery caramel, and ice cream parlor. And I get blueberry and I get, I get the ice cream parlor. I would say the two that stand out most to me are the blueberry and the ice cream parlor. So pretty though. What, how much is, um, I'm not really up on the uh, price, prices for things. And you know what the thing is, is that some people won't get this because it's too much I, I mean, because they'll, they don't want to pay that much, but I, for those of you who appreciate this kind of thing, then, you know, it's worth it, I guess. Okay, here's the next one. Let me take it out. And I've got pulled up. This is $3.05. Hmm. These are, let me see, what is the details on there? It's, this is in the scent Fast Pitch. And these are um, cow or pig embeds. And they're colored using mica powder and scented in Fast Pitch. And Fast Pitch is bourbon wood, which is coconut, cardamom, blushed wine, green cognac, cassis, vanip, van, whipped vanilla, ginger, whiskey shot, molasses, sheer musk, patchouli, and mold spice. <laughs> That's what bourbon wood is. Vermont, honey, apple, and maple sugar. These smell absolutely incredible, and they're 1.4 ounces. So did you get that? Bourbon wood, Vermont, honey, apple, and maple sugar. So it's a, that's a cow, correct? Yes. And then look, they've got the triple colors on them and mica on the bottom. I get, I think I get mostly the bourbon wood. There is definitely some booziness in this. There's definitely, but that's why, that's why I got it. <laughs> Kind of like boo sweet boozy scents. So how cute. It smells good, but I don't know if that one's for everyone. And then the last one, I told you I only got three because I just wanted to try them out, is this adorable little tart. And this is $3.30. Ooh, it's got some things on the bottom. This one is my favorite out of all of them, believe it or not. And there's still some left on the website. I have to order some more. Oh, there's only one left. <laughs> okay, so run, get it. So these are um, adorable mini soy and beeswax tarts with cherry wax embeds 
and it is in the scent Wash, Dry, Repeat, which is cherry vanilla and clean cotton. Let's just take a look at the artistry on this. Oh my gosh, I can smell it's very. I like cherry bakery scents. I've got like a candle burning over here. That's a cherry cupcake scent. I love cherry, vanilla, cherry. And then it's got, it's with clean cotton too. So it gives it like a little added, like, like something in the background. It's just so, you know, that's different. To me, it's a different combination. But yeah, cherry vanilla and clean cotton. And these are, how many ounces did it say this was? Uh, did it say? 1.4 ounces. 1.4 ounces. Yeah. Mmm, I love it. I love that one. This, that's my, my jam right there. Okay. So. That is it for the tarts that I ordered. But let me, I want to show you something. I'm going to pull it up on the web. I'm on the website here. And I want to show you something that I'm like super impressed with. It is a custom 14 ounce loaf. I want you to look at it. Oh my gosh, right? Look at the, look at that. Let's just scroll through the pictures. I mean, isn't that incredible? Oh, wow. I'm all about the prettiness. I don't apologize. Anyway, so that is my small little haul from Sassy Wax Melts. Fun package to get. Very impressed with the presentation of everything that I'm receiving. I mean, like the presentation, the labels, the, the, the scent descriptions on the labels, the pour date on the labels, the bags, the card, the way it was packaged with all the candy and the cute little gift box, the, the de attention to like the littlest detail Oh my gosh, this makes me so happy. <laughs> this is like a gift. This is this was my gift to myself for Valentine's Day. And um, it's it's awesome. <laughs> so go check out Sassy Wax, Wax Melts. Again, though that's the places that you can reach. Etsy.com slash shop backslash Sassy Wax Melts. And on Instagram at Sassy Wax Melts. Thank you so much, Cheryl, and um, I hope that I'll be able to order again real soon. Thanks for watching, y'all. Bye.